Welcome back to another first look at Pokemon Unite. Again, we're playing on the Japanese beta. Going to uh, show off Greninja today, which is probably my favorite out of all of them. Greninja is definitely incredibly powerful. It feels like the least sin from League of Legends. It feels like the least sin of Pokemon Unite, you know? So I'm going to... Oh, I got the wrong item. You want to get the bubble first. The, the, the dash is not as effective. You'll put out a little substitute. The bubble does some good early damage. So you want to try to get the bubble earlier. The substitute's cool when you uh no one's no one's jungling. Oh no, she is. Okay, she's jungling. The substitute's cool when you're trying to get away. So if there's like an early gank, you can try to get away. But really, really enjoying uh the early stages of this game as well. Even leveling up is fun. There are, there is a little fight happening, actually. I'm gonna go over there and see if I can't help that out. Let's see. Is you, are you still chasing him? Are you still? Is he still being chased? Or did you lose him? He looks like he lost him. He's just jungling now. Okay. All right. I think we can just keep moving. Oof. Get him. Get him. So we can dump. Let's dump. Love that there's no turrets in this game. Again, uh, League of Legends similarities, but not a lot of like not a whole bunch, right? Like, okay, I don't want to fight him actually. Oh, see, I, I messed that up. I shouldn't have used that yet. You want to save that for the actual engage, you know? I don't want to deal with Bulbasaur right now. Not a good look for me. Oof. But now you get to make a choice. I'm going to go. We got him. We got him. We got him. He's dead. This is hard because you can get the stealth or you can get, uh, you know, I'm going to go with the clones though. I do like the stealth. The stealth is really good, but I also feel like stealth is more effective when you have communication, right? Oof. We got him. Let's got him. Come on, baby. Ah, oh, the heal. The heal. What's he going to do? He's got anything on me? No, he's not. All right. I'm not dealing with that right now. I guess we could. We could. Yeah, we got this. Yes. Just barely. Don't step in the poison. There we go. I think I have time to get over here and just dump it really quick before they show up. Yeah. There we go. You love to see it. Love to see it. Go back, get some fruit, heal up, get some shields. Love it. I love it when a plan's coming together. So the stealth, yeah, like I said, so you roll and you stealth is the other move. And uh, super awesome, super effective. Now, this is where it kind of gets interesting. You can either have the, sh the water shurikens, which you have to you have to aim, but it does a ton of damage if you hit. And then you also have this, uh, this ride the wave thing. I'm actually going to do the ride the wave thing because it is so awesome. I think, I'm not actually completely sure, I believe that the ride the wave thing, um, it resets. Yeah, it resets. So if I, if I can just keep beating him up, there we go. There we go. I got some, there you go. It resets. If you get a kill with it, it resets. So super useful for just doing tons and tons of damage and then getting out of there, right? Like that. Bam. So much damage. Really, really love it. Really, really love it. Okay, I'm going to get out here now. Now I have my ultimate, though, which is super handy. I'm going to get out of here, though, because uh, I'm probably going to die from one more hit. So, But as you can see, just super uh, mobile. mobile uh, well, hang on. How do I say this word? Mobile. <laughs> like your phone. It's cellular. Speaking of, got to beat this Rotom. Transform to the other side. There we go. Nuke him. Teleport with it. Do some damage. There you go. There we go. There we go. Get that Absol. Here we go. Get the Absol. There we go. Got him. Got him. Just, just got a nuke, baby. Uh-oh. I am worried about him. I am worried about him. Uh-oh. I'm, I'm getting out of here, actually. Unless I can just kind of poke. No, we got him. The damage that me and this uh, Pikachu can do, man, is pretty nuts. I will say. There 
There we go. We got this. Oh, here we go. Ooh, Absol. Not nuking me, baby. Not nuking me. I'm going to get out of here, though. Oof. Very, very close for me. So, yeah, you can use your dash as a way to get away as well. Really confuse them. Jump into a bush. They're both effective for that. You have two, like I said, you have the uh, one that kind of puts up a smoke cloud and it stealths you. I'm pretty sure anyone inside your smoke cloud uh, makes it so that they can't hit you either. So really, really useful. I am, I do not want to mess with this, uh, this guy. It does hurt. Do like, I do, I actually will mess up her though. Yeah, there we go. I don't think I can fight those. No. A little weak for me. I'll take it though. I've, I've been on a good roll. I've definitely deposited a lot of a lot of points and I've uh, gotten quite a few kills. So it's weird though, because Greninja is supposed to be a harder to play class. Um, but so far, I got, I would say the hardest class I've played is probably Slowbro. And I'll be making a video about him too. Slowbro's abilities are uh, a little interesting. I actually don't really understand his sleep one. Maybe someone can uh, teach me that before I do this. But uh, yeah, his sleep one. I don't know if you stop moving and he just keeps healing or what. Snorlax I haven't played either, but man, is is he super strong. What I'm going to do is... There we go. There we go. Oh, I thought I was going to reset it. Didn't reset it on that one. We are just nuking these guys, though. They really got nothing on us. Yeah, we just we just do so much damage. I feel kind of bad for him. You know. Okay, okay. Let me get out of there. There we go. Uh oh. Uh oh. All right, I got 50 points, baby. We're going to just, I'm just going to nuke this. All right, I'm not going to, I'm not going to deal with that. Oh, he's dead. He's gone. But I will uh, deposit these 50 points because that's uh, pretty spicy. And it looks like they're completely ignoring me. They're all top lane. So I think I'm going to be able to get this 50 muckaroos right there. Let's go ahead and get the turtle down here. The turtles are pretty cool. They give you uh, a little shield. I'm not sure what Zapdos gives you just yet. There we go. All right. Cool stuff so far, though. I, uh, you know what? I'm going to go. I'm going to go north. You know, I'm going to jump in. Actually, I'm going to just press B because I have a shield. I'm going to get in there and help out the team. Because, uh, yeah, they got a shield in here. Yeah, there we go. Got him. All right. Easy to pick people off, which I love too. Really fun. Really enjoy that. Yeah, Greninja overall, just a really fun character. Uh, it feels very freeing to be able just to kind of move around and pick people off. And if you're good enough, you can get in, get out. Now, this is where it gets a little dicey, though. Either I can cut somebody off right here. Looks like we're already handling it pretty well. Or I can just, like, mess him up. There we go. I do so much damage. He really doesn't stand a chance. But Champ, I am worried about. I don't think I can... I don't think I can mess up with Champ. Maybe I can. If I can get everyone together. Yep. Yeah. All right. Oh, I don't want to deal with that right now. I'm going to run away from that. Oh, okay, I could have got that. 50 points though to go we uh we're kind of wrecking not gonna lie i don't think they stand really much of a chance right now now if you get to their base as well you can just automatically deposit everything right so i can just uh i can just really just throw it in there get that 50 in there throw down that ah uh, ah uh, my shuriken didn't exactly go off but we're good man i think i think that death you know that death doesn't really matter What's cool about this game, too, is it, it doesn't really reward you for going around just ganking people. Because if you're ganking people, but then you're still dying in the end, and you're just giving them your points, all that all that energy you've collected, it's uh, it's not effective. So the game has really found a way 
and developers have found a way to make it so that you need to be in these team fights you need to be a, a participant um because if you're not you really are just giving your the other team free stuff there's no there's no glory in going around killing people by yourself or trying to and then just dying in the process and but champ did drop off we got 988 to 205 it was worse than i thought uh, i thought it was a little more even but wow we uh we've kind of i think i'm three for three so far so this is good this is good let's see what we got so 16 kills 17 assists and 93 points deposited uh yeah so you guys you guys can see he's very very effective greninja is so much fun he just jumps around you can jump i think you can jump over walls i didn't really do that much with the shadow uh but you can jump over walls with it so it's super effective and uh yeah i liked having the power boost on him too being able to do any extra extra damage with greninja is super awesome makes them not targeting you uh more of a punishment right because you're just you're just ducking out so much damage super awesome so thank you guys for watching again please uh like and subscribe and all that jazz if you guys enjoy pokemon unite and uh, i'll see you on the next one i think the next one's gonna be garchomp so tune in